Well, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. I'm back again. This time, I have decided that I'm finally going to do my Al Picasso collection video. And <laughs> I don't know how much you can see, but I'm surrounded by Al Picasso right now, and it's a little intimidating. <laughs> you don't realize how many you have until you, like, take them from all of their displays and, like, put them all together in one place. So this might be long. Um, bear with me. I'm probably not going to show series tags just to try to speed up the process a little bit, but yeah, let's get into it. I'm going to go from small size to large size. So, to begin with, I have the 8 centimeter Alpa, uh, Alpa Cafe, the pink maid. I got this from uh, the through Bai from the Yahoo Japan auctions. It's my first 8 centimeter. I have three of the Goodnight series. I have uh, the yellow, the blue, and the purple. Um, this one was from, what's it called? I can't even think of the name anymore. Um, I did a review on my Tumblr. It was from a uh, British store that his, has been known for selling bootlegs, so not recommended. I got um, the sheep from that one as well. So these were both from the same place. Like I said, I did a review on my Tumblr and I will link that down below if you're interested. Um, the purple one I got from Tokyo Otaku Mode, and the beige one I think I also got from Tokyo Otaku Mode, but I don't remember for sure. <laughs> and then I have my two princes, which I showed in a recent video. I've got the beige and the blue, also from the Yahoo Japan Auctions. And my two Edens, again from the Yahoo Japan Auctions. Alright, and now moving up to the ball chain size. I have the uh, white Sherbert Kid. This one I got from uh, Tavina. I'm not sure what her Tumblr is. It might be that, or she may not have one. But she's uh, she was she got me in the first um, Albacasso Forum mystery swap, and she sent me this little guy. He's super cute. I also have the um, I think this is the Sweet Day. Yeah. The Al Picasso Kids Sweet Day series. This was in a um, mystery bag from Tokity Shop. He's a cute little guy too. I have the Christmas. I think this is the second Christmas series. Um, this one is from the Yahoo Japan Auctions. I like his little bell. We have the uh, Kindergarten Kids series, the Cutie Kids. This was from Kawaii Day. We have the pink Cafe maid, which I'm obsessed with. This one I got from Alpaca Loco on Tumblr, and she said it was like a special edition one, so it doesn't have the normal tags. And this one is also from Alpaca Loco. This is the Kids Cafe series, and this is the, the beige waiter. I have the mint green pop and ribbon. This one... I want to say Tokyo Otaku Mode or Pixie. I'm sorry, I don't remember exactly where I got all of them. I'm doing my best. <laughs> but I'll link all of the stores that I mentioned down below. I have the purple girly Al Picasso series. This one is from Tokyo Otaku Mode. And I have the beige antique girl. This one is from a seller that I bought a large albacasso from. She included this one. I think her Tumblr username is General Anakin. She was very sweet. She included this for free. That was really nice of her. Is that all of them? No. I have the um, Dreamy Ribbon Llama, which I have the large size of. So I had to have the smaller size to complete. Not, not to complete the set, but just to add to it. And that is all of my ball chain. Okay, are you following me still? Now we're going into standard size, 16 centimeter. I'm gonna start with, uh, this is actually the first Alvacasso I ever bought. This is from Tokyo Takamo. This is the pink Sherbert Kid. I bought her, I pre-ordered her, so she, right when the Sherbert Kids were released was when I first started collecting Alvacasso. So she's kind of near and dear to my heart for that reason. Um, and then I also have the purple one which has the, uh, has Rosie's, gar Rosie's garden, um, her little 
Halloween mystery costume set on it because I think it looks cute. Um, and this one I got from Rosie's Garden as well, separately. <laughs> I also got a blue one at the time, but I have sold that one, so I hope he's happy in his new home. And let's see, moving on, I have the Makaiba Kids. Um, did I show that? I don't think I did. I have the Ball Chain Makaiba Kids as well. I have the Makaiba Kids sheep in every size. So that was the ball chain. I showed you the eight centimeter. This is the standard size. The ball chain and the standard size were both from Kawaii Plush Love. And I have, I'll just do all the kids first, I guess. <laughs> I have a pink Prince Kids. This I bought from uh, Plushy Levy on Tumblr. And adults, I have the blue Goodnight, which I also have every size of. No, I don't. I don't have the ball chain. If you know somebody who has the ball chain of the Blue Goodnight series, please let me know because I want him so that I can complete the set. Um, this was also part of Tokity Shop's uh, mystery bag that I got the, the little white one in. I have the Hatter series, Llama, because I love llamas. And something about the way he's wearing his hat is really cute to me. <laughs> this I got from... I don't remember, maybe Tokyo Otaku Mode, or I think from Pixie, actually, from Pixie. I'm sorry, I'm lame, I don't remember. This is the Necktie Series Llama. This one I got in my Halloween mystery bag from Rosie. Um, Antique Series Purple. This one, I believe, was Tokyo Otaku Mode. And the Cocoa Brown Colored, um, what is this? The Waku Waku Party series. I unboxed this in a video and I, I honestly don't remember. I think it may have been Pixie that I got it from. Or Albacasso SG. Ugh, I don't know. I'm gonna link everybody down below. I'm sorry. I apologize. Got the uh, Velvet Ribbon Llama. This one is from Tokyo Otaku Mode. Um, I have the Albacasso Core Alpaca. Uh, the white one. This one was a freebie from Pixie. This is actually my boyfriend's. I gave it to him when I got it because I don't really like this series, but I included it because we live together, so they're all here anyway. <laughs> um, and then I think the last 12 cent or 16 centimeter I have is my newest one, which is the Happy Snow Llama. And this one I got from Jelly's Nancy when she organized a group order. Okay, um, next in size, I will show you my Albacasso backpack. Uh, this I got from Tumblr user X Macaron, who's a collector in the community. She bought it from Bai and then decided that she didn't want it, so I bought it from her. It's super cute. It's very soft and fuzzy, um, and I haven't used it yet, <laughs> but hopefully I will. I think it's just it's cute. Why not? You know. Okay, are we ready for the large size now? Whew. Let's see. Oh, I'm so intimidated. <laughs> Alright, let's start with... This was my first large size. This is the Makaiba Kids Cheap. Again, like I said. Uh, the, this was the first series that I was able to like complete all of the, the Sheep Kid ones. And I also got him from Tokyo... Or no, from um, Kawaii Plush Love. So I bought every size of him from Kawaii Plush Love, except for the 8cm. And uh, the large size are the only ones that I named. So his name is Aries because he's a ram, and that's my zodiac sign. I'm an Aries, so I, it seemed it seemed appropriate. Um, and to go with him, I have the Makaiba Kids girl, the pink girl. This is from Tokyo Otaku Mode. Um, it was purchased in a group order with uh, that was run by um, Emlissa on Tumblr. So she sent she sent this guy to me. She's super cute. I love the bell. That's like my favorite thing. Uh, her name is Persephone, so I went for kind of a Greek mythology theme here. Um, I thought it was fitting because Persephone is associated with the spring, and she seems very springy with to me. And, you know, she's kind of pomegranate colored. Maybe not quite, but... So that's these two guys. I'm gonna run out of room so fast. <sighs> okay, um... Next I have... Oh, let's do this one. This was my first adult size Alpacasso. This is the Dreamy Ribbon Llama, and uh, she is from Tokity Shop. 
and her name is Lemon Drop because <laughs> she's lemon yellow. I love this one so much. She will always be kind of significant to me because she was my first large size and she's still one of my favorites. Moving on, I have see, the other one that stays on my bed with me is my purple macaron, which I have a video unboxing this one. Uh, this is from the Yahoo Japan auctions and hair, sorry, I shed a lot. <laughs> um, her name, his name, his name is Gumdrop because he reminds me of those little like candied gumdrops that you get, the color. I don't know. This is also one of my favorites. This was a dreamy for me. Um, back here, another one of my favorites. This is my Alba Cafe Made Adult. This one I got from Jelly's Fancies online shop. And she's so, she's so precious. I love her so much. I was so excited to get this one. I have a video unboxing her as well. Her name is Mocha, even though she's not <laughs> mocha flavored or anything like that, or flavored, colored. <laughs> um, I wanted to give her a coffee related name and Mocha seemed like the best like feminized name I could think of because she's a little cafe maid. So it, it seemed fitting to me. And in companionship with her, I have the kids version this one I bought off of um, Plushy Pants on Tumblr, who is a good friend of mine in the community. She's super, super precious. And her name is Chino, which is short for like cappuccino. I thought it was cute because she's like, she's a little version. So she's not the full cappuccino. <laughs> anyway, I, I don't really have a rhyme or reason to how I name these. I just kind of come up with whatever I come up with. They're super precious. Let's see. I have my gorgeous llama, who I haven't really come up with a name for yet. I'm still thinking. I like the name Meringue. I think I'm going to go with Meringue because the fur kind of like the way that it's like swirled makes me think of Meringue. So I think that's it. Meringue. This one I got from the uh, Yahoo Japan auctions. Again, I have a video unboxing her. Oh, let's see. Where are we now? <laughs> I have... Oh! My large blue goodnight alpacaso. I love this one so much. This is from Tokyo Otaku Mode. And his name is Ebenezer, like Ebenezer Scrooge, because his little nightcap just makes me think of that. He I love him. He's one of my favorites. I just think the color is so pretty. And he's so he's so cute with his little sleeping hat. Um oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is a newer one for me as well. Um recently unboxed this one. This is one that I thought I wasn't going to keep, but once I saw her, I fell in love. <laughs> I love her so much. She's super cute. She's from the Yahoo Japan Auctions. And again, I haven't come up with a name for her yet. Obviously, I want to do something like wintry, maybe like Frosty. Frosty's kind of a cute name, but I don't know. I'm going to think about it some more and we'll come up with something. She's so precious. All right. Oh, this is the... um. Nuku Nuku Warm and Fuzzy series, I think. It's the earmuff. I just call it the earmuff series. Um, moving on, I have my Cotton Candy Llama. Again, another recent purchase from the Yahoo Japan Auctions. There's a video on her. This is one that I was really excited for, and then now I'm not so sure. I might sell her. I'm, I don't know. I don't know. She's really cute, but um, I'm not as in love with her as... I thought I was going to be, so I have not named her because I'm toying with the idea of selling her, but she's really big, really, really stuffed and cute and cozy. Um, let's see, this is the last one from the Yahoo Japan auctions, like that box that I opened that was the last three of them. This is the Natural Llama. This one I'm pretty sure I am going to sell um, because as precious as she is, I'm just not sold on the color. So again, no name for now. I have her. I'm probably, probably going to be selling her though. So there's that one. Oh boy. Here I have the gray girly series, which is super cute. But again, I've had him for a while. I bought him new from Tokyo Otaku Mode and I think I'm ready to let him go. So I think I am going to sell him as well. 
Um, his name, though, is Earl Grey, because <laughs> I think that's a really cute name. I've had him long enough that I have named him. He's so little, though. Like, I really like the big, the big cuddly, stuffy ones. And let's see. Here I have my purple ballerina from Rosie's Garden. I am so in love with this one. She's so gorgeous and so cute. She's very floppy. I haven't restuffed her yet. I'm planning to. But she's just, oh, I love her so much. And her name is Clara, after Clara from The Nutcracker, which is pretty much the only ballet I know. So <laughs> that's her name. And last but not least, I have my Olympic series, France Al Picasso which is another one that I've very much grown to love. This is the one that I bought off of the Tumblr user, Jenna, General Anakin, who included the little um, ball chain one for free, which is really sweet. And I love, I love him so much. She told me that his name was Avignon when she had him, which is a region in France, and I really like that name, so I've kept that for now. So his name is Avignon, and he's a little cutie pie. So, yeah. I'm looking around and I'm pretty sure I got them all. That was my El Picasso collection. It may not seem like that many compared to some other collectors, but to me it's a lot considering like the small space that I live in. Um, but I love them all and I'm really happy with them. I think I'm actually like pretty comfortable with where my collection is now. So I don't know how much I'll be collecting in the future, but I think I'm actually going to try to sell off some of the ones that I'm not super crazy about and just kind of keep my collection tight because I like that better, but yeah. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this, and I think mm, the next thing I want to do, other than like unboxings, is I would like to do a video of my like non al Picasso Amuse collection, so all my loppies and woolies and whatever mis miscellaneous ones that I have. I think that'd be kind of fun. So I might be doing that, and maybe I'll finally do some tag videos too. But yeah, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you in the next video.